everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel and happen to stumble by, I'm your girl Bella, and I would totally love if you join me on my YouTube adventures. Hi guys, happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday, everybody. How's it going? How's the week? Not bad, right? Not bad, our week's all right. Mine's okay, hope your week is off to a good start. Finally, finally motivated. Okay guys, I'm just gonna jump into the video. I am very, very motivated to finally get decorating this house. I finally got all the Christmas packed away and organized. That's why it took me a little longer than I wanted because I really wanted to organize it this year and I'm, I was so meticulous about it because ugh, I'm telling you, this past Christmas, well, when I started Christmas, I was like, I was searching for things couldn't find things and I vowed to myself that this year when I put the Christmas away that I would really 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 organize it and that's why I've been a little bit late into decorating but I am motivated I want to motivate you guys too to get up and you know refresh your homes and make them amazing for the winter season now I'm not a winter girl Okay, just putting that out there. I'm not a big winter girl, I'm not a winter lover, but I love to make my home comfy, cozy, welcoming, yet high-end looking, but on a budget. I'm a budget girl. I love doing things on a budget. If you haven't noticed, every time I do a shopping haul, I only buy things on sale or on clearance. That's it. When, and use a coupon if possible. So I'm very budget friendly. I I love decorating, you all know that. And that's why I do this. <laughs> um, but I love, love, love making my house feel very high end mm -hmm, on a budget. And you know, kind of a little designer like. I get my inspiration from Pinterest, from Instagram, I love scrolling through Instagram, seeing those big accounts with all the like amazing decor or, you know, or magazines, love magazines. Okay, I'm rambling like always. The stuff I'm gonna use today is some of the things I bought um, on my last shopping haul, my last video, which I'll have linked at the end of this video. So if you didn't catch that video, it'll be linked at the end, you can go watch it. So let's jump into this. We're going to do my fireplace. As you can tell, I cleaned it all off. I scrubbed it down. I The house is all meticulously scrubbed down, clean. I mean, you name it. Baseboards, everything are done. I brought my um, grate back. It's like um, French doors and it has a scroll on the top. You'll see it after when I bring the, ca when I bring the camera off the tripod. But I want to start with this garland that I bought from Hobby Lobby. You guys have seen this a million times. And you know what I like about it? The color. I think the color is perfect for this time of year. So I'm gonna start with that. And sorry I have my back to you, but I wanna drape it so that it drapes down like this. And I'm not gonna use any command hooks or anything, and you'll see why in a minute. I'm gonna use my objects to hold it in place. I love it. Doesn't that look so pretty? It looks so pretty. I love this cascading. Okay, then I'm going to get some candles because I want it warm and welcoming. And I'm just going to play with this a little bit there. I want this long piece right in the middle. Okay, let me get my candle holders. Guys, I've had these candle holders for a long, long time. Um, I got them in a thrift store and then I whitewashed them and I'm going to use these battery operated candles that look like birch wood because it is still winter time. So that's what I want to do. And I'm just going to put the tallest one here. And then one which is a little shorter and they're really nice if you can find yourself some really nice uh, tall wooden candlesticks this would be really great okay 
Okay, so this is what I'm going to do to hold my garland in place. I'm kind of wrapping it around my candle holders and then pulling it forward like that. So it drapes and it looks really, really pretty. And I think that looks nice. I think it looks very nice. Okay, now I want to use these. I purchased these just recently. You saw them in my last video. I love them. There's two of them. I'm going to use them as a centerpiece right here. So I'm going to do the tallest on this side. And the shorter one on this side. And what I'm doing, just to give it some depth and some interest, I'm putting one further back than the other, just to give it that interest. And then again, I'm going to wrap some of this garland around it so you don't see the base of it. Just so it makes it look a little, you know, interesting and stuff. There you go. So I think that's good. Okay, on the other side now, because I want it to balance out. And I'm telling you, this is a very, very, very simple, simple design. Let me I'm show you what I'm thinking. Decor neutral. And I know you've seen this vase. I have two of them. I love them. They are from Hobby Lobby. When I purchased them, they were $29.99, and I'm sure I got them 50% off. I love these. If you can see the, oh, it's very bright. Um, you could see the texture in them, and I love the coloring and the texture. And I also love this that makes it look like it's been sitting outdoors for a long, long time. Now, I want to put this vase here. And again, I'm sorry for having my back to you, but there's nothing more I can do. <laughs> so, I'm going to put this vase here to mimic uh, the height that I have on the other side with the candle holders. But I'm gonna put some greenery in. Now, I went down to my storage room and I have a lot of greenery, a lot. I've been, uh, you know, I collected from year to year. Let me show you the one I'm thinking about. It's this one here. I like this, I'm gonna use four of them. I like this very much. It's from Hobby Lobby also, I love this like twiggy stuff that kind of falls down and these branches and the dark leaves because the darkness of this matches the the garland so i think it'll coordinate really really well together so all i did is bend the stem to the desired height and then i'm just going to put my stems in like this and i told you i'm using four so you just place your stems in, whichever way you, you see fit. Okay, now here's the trick. I want some of my stems going every which way. So I just kind of move them around. And this is the best part of having a full greenery because you can just, that's wired, you can just manipulate it any which way you want. You can have it come out more, come out less, sit up taller. I mean, I just think it's beautiful. And I want it to look organic and kind of messy, like in nature. There, perfect. I love it. I love it. And I think it looks really good together. Okay, now let me show you what else I want to do. When I stood back and looked at my mantle, I thought, oh, it looks good. But I could just add that one little small touch pine cones they're these pine cones i had them from a christmas i had them down in my stash and i think that if i add some pine cones here like this it is just gonna elevate my design 
that much more. Hold on, let me get this one. That much more. So I think it gives it a little interest for winter. Let me see. Here. I'm gonna stand this one up. I think it looks cute. I'm gonna bring you off the tripod to show you, but you know what it needs? It needs a little audio. end of the video i hope you enjoyed this video i hope i didn't babble too much i hope it gave you lots of motivation to go down in your storage areas or in your storage closets and find things that you have that are simple yet elegant and think outside the box because i mean truthfully this is not um you know, it's not that much stuff, but I think when you pair it all together, it gives that really nice high-end look. Have a fantastic day. I hope you're having a fantastic week. And guess what, guys? I will see you on Friday. I have a great DIY for my French country-loving girls. That's what I want to do on Friday. I saw something and I want to recreate it. So if you love French country, Come back and see me on Friday and we'll do an amazing DIY together on a budget, like super budget. Cause I've seen how much those cost and they're expensive. <laughs> bye YouTube, bye everybody. Have a great, great day girls and boys and men. And I will see you very, very soon. Mwah. Bye guys.